Uh, you tweeted uh, about various subjects, actually. It's interesting, your tweet experience. But one of the things you tweeted about was Bitcoin, that you were still thinking about about a month ago now. Uh, we now have uh, the LME saying that they're actually, CME, sorry, uh, actually saying they're going to uh, start trading in futures on uh, Bitcoins Bitcoin. are a little too tangible for the London Metals Exchange. <laughs> yeah, that's right, exactly. Yes. So, but, but there is, so the CME is going to have futures uh, with Bitcoin. Uh, are you still thinking about it? And if Goldman customers, your customers come to you and say, we really want to have this as part of our portfolio, do you have any choice but to get involved in Bitcoin? Look, I have, I have a level of discomfort with it, as I have a dis level of discomfort with anything that's new. But I've learned over the years that there's a lot of things that work out pretty well that I don't, that I don't love. I remember when they first came out with cell phones, I'm thinking, why would anybody want this thing? It lasts, you know, battery lasts about 10 minutes, it weighs a, you know, weighs a ton, you have to have it on your back. And there's, there's, uh, there's phone machines every 15 feet. Why would anyone want this? Guess what, I missed that one. <laughs> and here, I know, I read a lot of history, and I know once upon a time, a coin was worth $5 if it had $5 worth of gold with it. And then a, a piece of paper was worth $5, but only if it was backed by gold in the, in the treasury or silver in the silver certificate. And even then, people were suspicious. Now we have paper that's only backed by fiat. The government says, I think that's what it's worth. Maybe in the new world, something gets backed by consensus. Right. Instead of a government fiat, maybe it's a consensual arrangement by people that agree that it's worth something, kind of like what social media does. It's not my natural state of comfort. But if you told me that, you know, if we went into the future and Bitcoins were successful, I would be able to explain how it's a natural evolution hmm. from hard money. By the way, why is gold worth anything yeah. more than the jewelry value in gold? Yeah. That's kind of a consensus mm -hmm. that people have mm -hmm. because no government says, I'm going to pay you $1,300 an ounce from gold. It just is that. If somebody, why is it worth that? You can't mm -hmm. eat it. Why is it worth that? Because it's been like that for a long time. Mm -hmm. And so maybe 200 years from now, even someone like me might be comfortable with it. But right now, I tell you, I don't have an investment <laughs> in it, but I'm not willing to poo-poo it, and that's why I say I'm open to it.